That's right, Carolyn. You can just feel the Hollywood buzz here in Warren. They are trying to attract the bright lights of Hollywood here and turn this big warehouse into a movie studio. Lights, camera, action. Warren, Michigan's third largest city, is trying to make it big in the movie business, angling to get a movie studio in this massive building. The facility is well suited for the movie industry. Uh, we had a movie shoot in there this summer. It went extraordinarily well. Ken Jacobson is the CFO of HB Stubbs, a company that makes displays for the auto show. They've been here at this 19-acre megaplex at 11 Mile and Mound for over four decades. They're hoping to sell the building now to Crane Media, a movie studio based in L.A. We're looking at many scenarios with this particular company, one that would uh, have them using uh, the facility partially perhaps to shoot their first movie. But to get Crane to Warren, H.B. Stubbs needs a tax abatement, and that's where the Warren City Council comes into play. Tonight, the council voted unanimously to approve the first step in making the abatement a reality. The abatement is uh, approximately 50% credit on real and personal property taxes for up to 12 years. There is no hearing scheduled yet for the abatement, but officials are confident it will pass. The fact that they're looking at a large number of job, jobs and a large investment, certainly the city is supportive. And Crane Media is known for movies like Face Off and Look Who's Talking, which of course starred John Travolta. As for Crane Media, we did try and contact them tonight, but we were unable to get them. We'll, of course, keep you posted on any new developments here. Reporting live in Warren, I'm Tom Wade. Channel 7 Action News, Carolyn, back to you. Yeah, a lot of people interested in that, and certainly those new jobs. Thanks a lot, Tom. All right, less than a